Hello guys welcome to my new video. 2024 Kia Sorento Expert Review Alex leans larger than the Sportage but smaller than the Telluride. The Sorento is somewhat of a niche vehicle in Kia's SUV lineup. Although it fits into the midsize SUV category, the Sorento's standard third row seat makes it an unusual entrant in the segment. Made in West Point, Georgia, this generation of Sorento was introduced for the 2021 model year, and it receives updated styling and fresh features this year. The 2024 Kia Sorento competes against two row midsize SUVs such as the Subaru Outback, Jeep Grand Cherokee, and Honda Passport. Kia also offers the Sorento with hybrid and plug in hybrid powertrains, reviewed separately. Collapse All Chevron What's new Chevron updated styling with bigger grille, bolder lights? New hood standard 12.3 inch infotainment touchscreen among new tech features interior gets reworked touch points and controls new exterior paint colors and interior upholstery choices rugged X Pro variant introduced. What we think Chevron having lived with the Kia Sorento for a year in our long term review fleet, we know this SUV well. And for the most part, we like it. The updates for 2024 appear to add fresh appeal to a solid, if rather unusual, SUV. Unusual in the sense that most three-row SUVs are larger, and therefore generally more spacious, than the Sorento. Yet it's still packaged well enough to hold passengers in its rearmost seat, or within a footprint that's smaller and more manageable than other seven-seaters cargo space is sufficient to enable a variety of lifestyle pursuits. The cabin looks attractive and premium, although we're not thrilled with Kia's decision to put the dual-function touch-sensitive controls found in some of its other vehicles in the 2024 Sorento. With its turbocharged engine, the Sorento drives nicely. There's plenty of torque available. But this engine's dual clutch transmission can stutter and jerk slightly. Ride and handling are poised and refined, if not thrilling. The new X Pro model promises greater off road capability than ever, or at least the look of it. Even if the Sorento isn't the ideal three row SUV for everyone, it offers a good combination of practicality, capability, driving enjoyment, and value. If you're feeling overwhelmed by the variety of SUVs out there, perhaps the Sorento's in-betweener approach will appeal to you. Performance and MPG's Chevron engines in the updated 2024 Sorento carry over from previous model years. The base offering is a 2.5-liter i4 that produces 191 horsepower and 181 pounds to feet of torque. That's sent through an 8-speed automatic transmission to standard FWD, or available AWD. Fuel economy should come in at about 24-29 mile per gallon city, highway with FWD and 23-25 mile per gallon with AWD. Higher-end Sorento models upgrade to a turbocharged 2.5-liter i4 that makes 281 horsepower and 311 pounds to feet of torque. It's also joined to an 8-speed automatic transmission, this one being a dual-clutch type. Likewise, FWD is standard and AWD is available. Acceleration from 0 to 60 miles per hour should take approximately 6.3 seconds like previous Sorentos we tested with this engine. Fuel economy should rate at around 22.29 mile per gallon with FWD and 22.27 mile per gallon with AWD. The X Pro model may be slightly slower and less efficient on account of its burly off-road tires. For better fuel economy, 
Kia also builds two electrified Sorentos, the Sorento Hybrid and Sorento Plug-in Hybrid. Hybrid and FEF models round out the lineup. Chevron Kia will offer the Sorento with available hybrid and plug-in hybrid driver trains as it has in the past. We've praised the hybrid's good fuel economy and neutral chassis tuning. However, it suffers from a small third row just like its gasoline-only counterpart. The Sorento plug-in hybrid is also great to drive for a mid-size SUV, but we've noted that its F range quickly depletes. The Sorento FF's battery is slow to charge as well. Of the two electrified Kia SUVs, we'd stick with Sorento Hybrid. Sorento X Pro, ready to go off-road? Chevron building on the rugged-looking X-Line trim, Kia goes further in giving the Sorento actual off-road performance with the new X Pro trim introduced for 2024. In addition to the lockable all-wheel drive system and molded skid plate garnish found on the X-Line, the Sorento X Pro gets 17-inch wheels wrapped in BF Goodrich all-terrain tires, which should be more grippy and durable than the standard all-season rubber. Additionally, the X Pro can tow up to 4,000 pounds, the most of any Sorento model. Distinctive styling elements include new earthy road rider brown and jungle green exterior paints, as well as olive brown and sage interior upholstery colors. Safety features Chevron Driver Assist and Active Safety features are enhanced in the Sorento for 2024. All models include front automatic emergency braking, intersection collision mitigation, lane keep assist, and automatic high beams. Higher end models gain camera based blind spot monitoring, automatic lane changing, and a new adaptive cruise control system that learns to mimic the driver's acceleration and braking patterns. Cargo space and interior room Chevron interior measurements and capacities aren't expected to change on the 2024 Sorento. It continues to offer three-row seating within a mid-size SUV package. Leg room, first slash second slash third rows, cargo space, behind first slash second slash third rows. 2024 Kia Sorento 41.441.729.6 inches 75.545.012.6 cubic feet 2024 Subaru Outback 42.839.5 slash an inches 75 Six thirty seconds point six slash an acubic feet two thousand and twenty four Jeep Grand Cherokee L forty one point three thirty nine point four thirty point three inches eighty four point six forty six point nine seventeen point two cubic feet Technology Chevron instead of the 8.0 or 10.3 inch infotainment touch screens used in the Sorento previously. A new 12.3 inch unit is equipped in every 2024 model. In addition to the larger size, this screen benefits from increased processing power and a new user interface. Wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are standard on all trims. Entry level models have a 4.3 inch gauge cluster display while higher-end versions get a 12.3-inch all-digital display. A digital rear-view mirror is also newly available for 2024. All three rows of seats have access to USB-C port, and a wireless charging pad is available in the front row. New for 2024 is available phone as key functionality allowing owners to unlock and start the Sorento using only their smartphone. Trim levels Chevron The 2024 Sorento will be offered in LX, S, X, SX, and SX Prestige trim levels. The X-Line package can be optioned on the X grades and above, while X Pro can be equipped only on the range topping SX Prestige trim.
New Sorrento models are expected to go on sale in the first quarter of calendar year 2024. Look for hybrid and plug-in hybrid models to arrive later in 2024 as 2025 model year vehicles. Thanks for watching my video please subscribe my channel and like my video.